Hi everyone, Valentine Ose here for Graded Picture Playground. If this is your first time on this channel, hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell to get notified when new video is uploaded. I hope you all are doing well and you're following up with our tutorials. If you have suggestions or questions that you need to ask, drop it on the comment section, like our video and share with your friends who are interested in filmmaking and video editing specifically. So let's go. In this very tutorial, I want to show you how you can import logo into your legacy title. This is a process that enables you to bring your graphics into your legacy title. And this could be graphics that you created with Photoshop or Cinema 4D that you want to use in your Premiere Pro CC. To get it done, let's go to new. If you've not seen tutorials on how to use and locate the legacy title, hit the card icon to watch that tutorial. Come to your legacy title and it will take the timeline setting and you click on OK. So all you do is pick this icon and click on the center right click and you have a bunch of options. What you do is scroll down to your insert graphics and pick this. It will take you to wherever you likely have your graphics. So I have one which is my logo on my desktop. So I click on it and open. This is a PNG logo which I created out from Photoshop. So you, it can be any kind of logo that you want to work on you now have control over it you can now scale it down as you wish then you can place it anywhere it now have its own layer where you now have control so let's say i have to write title along with it which is the name graded picture playground this is it you pick your selection tool and take it close to this you can Hold down your control to make adjustments to the logo. So you pick both, then you can now align them to wherever you want it to be. So this is how you bring in your graphics, whether logo, whether any kind of thing that you may have designed, so long as either PNG or JPEG, you can insert it into your premiere pro through the legacy title i hope this tutorial helps and you've learned something from it if you have any question drop it on the comment section so that we all get interacted and other persons would learn i am valentine ose see you in our next tutorial